Today you will be examined for the mark of mastery. Not one, but two of the Keyblades chosen stand here as candidates. But this is neither a competition nor a battle for supremacy. Not a test of wills, but a test of heart. Both of you may prevail, or neither. But I am sure our guest, Master Xehanort, did not travel all this way to see our youngest prospects in years fall short of the mark. I trust you are ready. Yes. yes. Then let the examination begin. on the exam. But Ven, you're in danger here. Go wait in your room. No way. I've been looking forward to this. Seeing you two become masters. I'm not gonna miss it now. He can take care of himself. He's been out there training just as hard as us. Yeah. Stay sharp, Ven. That was unexpected. But one must keep a still heart even in the most trying of circumstances. It was an excellent test, one I chose to let unfold. Which brings us to your next trial. Now, Terra and Aqua, the two of you will face each other in combat. Remember, there are no winners, only truths. For when equal powers clash, their nature is revealed. Begin! We have deliberated and reached a decision. Terra, Aqua, you both performed commendably. However, only Aqua has shown the mark of mastery. Terra, you fail to keep the darkness within you sufficiently in check. But there is always next time. That is all. Aqua, as our newest Keyblade Master, you are entitled to certain knowledge. Please wait here for further instruction. Hey. Tara, I'm sorry. The darkness, where did it come from? What do you make of Ventus? He ain't gonna cut it. Somebody's got to break that loser in. Not here, you won't. 
I have to keep up appearances. I know that. He just needs a little incentive to leave home. <sighs> Sorry. But I need some time alone. <sighs> see Terra again. What? Get real! I can see Terra anytime I want. Like right now? He's leaving you behind. And by the time you catch up, he'll be a different person. Look, whoever you are, you don't know the first thing about Terra. Me and him will always be a team. You trying to pick a fight or what? Oh, grow up. Is that what you call friendship? You'll never know the truth unless you go out and look for it yourself. Come on, what could you possibly know when you're stuck here, looking at nothing but what's in the tiny world? It's okay.
Just trying to find a friend. His name is Terra. He's dressed kind of like me, about yay tall. Sounds like a tall tale to me. Go on, get! We don't know any Terra. <sighs> Please, could you come over here? I just want to talk. Don't fall for it. Stay where you are. All right. Then we'll do this the hard way.
I'm no thief. Ha! Ah, that's what they all say. Well, we're on to you. Fine, I get it. You want me to leave, I'll leave. Oh, but can you tell me where I can find some other people around here? There's a castle beyond the chorus. I mean the forest. Got it. Well, thanks.
Probably just seeing things. It happens to all of us when we're afraid. Oh, thank you. I feel quite better now. I'm sure I'll get along somehow. But I do need a place to sleep at night. Would you know anywhere I might? Well, I saw a house just up ahead. Come on, I'll take you there. Oh, I'm Ventus. Then, for short. Thank you, Then. My name's Snow White. Great. Let's get going.
sure you'll be safe here but sit tight while I look around someone's asleep in here the coast is clear not a monster in sight. Huh. Couldn't stay away, could you? And who invited you in, you rotten thief? Oh no, he's not a thief. He rescued me. You mustn't be more. I mustn't be fooled by him, Princess. Just go on and get! Please don't send him away. You see, he helped me when I was lost. And oh, so very frightened. What happened? Well, I was picking flowers by the wood, and there was a stranger there. He had a sword, but it was like a key. And then these monsters came and... A sword like a key? Terra! You mean this stranger saw you and sent his horde of evil demons after you? Terra would never do that! Oh, of course. I'm sure he wouldn't. Not if he's someone who's your friend. Princess, you trustn't be so musting. Uh, trusting. He's a lion! Mark my words! I'll prove it!
Excuse me, ma'am. You dropped this. Eh? Oh, I thank you, my pet. To tell the truth, I really don't know what I would have done without that. <laughs> Haven't I seen that sword before? Terra has one. You know Terra? Oh, yes, yes. That ruffian pointed one of those at me asking about some Xehanort. My poor heart nearly stopped. That doesn't sound like him at all. Ma'am, where did Terra go? I'm sure I have no idea. <sighs> Must you all menace a poor granny so? What? No, I, I was just... Tara, what did you do? Jack, what's all the fuss about? Somebody new in the house! Somebody never saw her for! Oh, a new friend! Where is he? In a trap trap! Down the stairs! Oh, dear! <sighs> what is going on? Tell me how I got so small! <sighs> Don't be afraid. Oh! How interesting. I've never seen a mouse like you before. Mouse? Jack, you better explain things to him. Uh. Huh? Now, now, now! Look a little guy, break her easy! Not a worry, pal! We like you! Flinda really like you too! She's a nice, very nice, nice! <laughs> Come on now! Jugs her! Name a Jack! I'm Ventus! Call me Vent! Jugs up, Ben Vent! Need a setup? Oh well, time to get to my chores. I'll see you in a little while then. Wow, I guess she's got her hands full. Just work, work, work. Step muddy, keep a Flinderelli busy all day. She didn't seem to mind much though. No, not so Flinderelli. She worked hard. Got a dream, big dream. Dream gonna come true. That sounds like somebody I know. Being a Keyblade Master is all I've dreamed about. Hey, maybe you can help me find him. His name's Terra. You seen him? Eh, uh, no, no. Never saw Terra before. Oh, well. It was worth a shot. Come on! Follow me! Gotta see the house! 
Hey! Cinderella going? <laughs> I don't know. Huh? Hello, you two. Have you become friends already? Oh, that's wonderful. You sure look happy, Cinderella. Hmm. I'm going to the royal ball tonight. I guess dreams really do come true. Cinderella! My dress will have to wait. Cinderella! Cinderella! All right, all right. I'm coming. Poor Cinderella. She not go to the ball. Why not? You see, they fix her. Work, work, work. She'll never get a dress done. Jack. With what? Fix up Linda Relly dress for the ball. But what do we need to get? Rock around the house. Lots of pretty, pretty things. Okay, let's do it. I'll go find whatever we need. Jacques, you get things set up here. Zuck, zuck. <sighs> ben, Ben, carefree Rusafi. Rusafi? Rusafi, a cat cat. Mean and sleepy. Gotcha.
Yeah! 
There it is. Thanks needed. You saved me before, so I saved you. That's what friends do, right? Tuk -tuk. Ben -ben -jaka, good friend. Now, let's get that dress finished. Oh well, what's a royal ball? After all, I suppose it would be frightfully dull and Boring and completely, completely wonderful. Cinderella! Is that my dress? Yes, it's a present from us. 
Now you have a dress for the ball. <laughs> Why, it's... it's such a surprise. Flurry, flurry! Time I go, Flinder, ready? Oh, thank you. Chuck-chuck, Hoopa Flinder, ready to ring, come true. What's up, inventory? I wonder. <laughs> Being a Keyblade Master is all I've dreamed about. Well, you're well, not, you're the, not only the only one. one. I know. I know. You, you, me, and Ven all, all share the same, the same dream. dream. Funny. I'd never really thought about it. At least until you asked me. My dream is to become a Keyblade Master. Hope a Ven Ven dream come true, too. I just need to keep on believing. Right? Suck, suck. sign of terror. From her. What? Oh, I'm sorry. It's just, I've never seen anyone so beautiful. Who are you? I'm Ventus. But you can call me Vent. Oh, you don't seem bad, dear. I'm certain you have a pure heart, just like our precious Aurora. Can you tell me why she's sleeping? Long ago, Maleficent cursed her. Now she's stolen her heart. Hmm. Well then, why don't I go get it back for her? That's impossible, dear. Maleficent's home is at the Forbidden Mountain. It's not safe. I'm not afraid. We, we can't just leave Aurora like this. I can help. You gotta believe me. Come on. Let's go get her heart. You know, you're absolutely right. The Forbidden Mountain is through the forest. Come along, follow us. After all, we wouldn't want you to get lost.
Stuck. This must be Maleficent's doing. I know. Shall we? Yep. Yeah! 
careful. They are Maleficent. Well, they ain't guarding nothing. Tension! No sleeping on the job. Yeah. 
That should do it. Don't you remember? We've met before. We... we have? Why, of course, you said so yourself. Once upon a dream. I never thought I would meet you. Outside of my dreams, that is. Who are you? What's your name? Hmm? Oh, my name. Why, it's... Oh, oh no, I can't. Goodbye. I must see you. I don't know. Maybe someday. When? Tomorrow? Oh, no. This evening. At the cottage in the Glen. What was that? Aurora's memory. She must have gotten her heart back. So her dream came true? Yes, not long ago. Dreams are very strong beliefs. Aurora's led her to her true love. I see you hold strong beliefs too, don't you, dear? Yep. You also have a strong light. Hmm. All right, hurry. We can't stay here. Someone has released Aurora's heart. Tell me, child, was it you? Maleficent! Only because you stole it in the first place! <laughs> A Keyblade? You must be Ventus. Huh? How do you know about me and the Keyblade? My powers ensure I'd know of the key to bringing me hearts. Terra gave me a demonstration. <laughs> Terra? He was here? Why, yes. In fact, it was he who stole Princess Aurora's heart. That's a lie! I was asked to leave you unharmed, but it seems I have no choice! Oh, yeah. 
There's no way Terra would hurt somebody like that. You don't believe me? That's unfortunate, for he agreed so easily. He did? Fen, don't be fooled! Huh? Aqua! Terra would never do that. You know that as well as I do. Yeah. Ah, the truth can be most cruel, even amongst the closest of friends. After all, one never knows the secrets of another's heart. I'm sure you'll agree, Ventus. Aqua. The Master sent me. Huh? Then, let's go home. But Terra... Terra's not ready to leave yet. Like right now? He's leaving you behind. And by the time you catch up, he'll be a different person. Sorry, Aqua. But... I can't go with you. What? It's just... I have to find him before it's too late. Then! Where's he hiding? Uh. <gasps> All right. What did you mean about Terra being a different person? Exactly what I said, idiot. The Terra you know will be gone forever. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Stupid or true? Uh. A Keyblade? Good. Let's see what you're made of. Yeah! Uh, 
too slow. Gotcha. That really all you got? Man, you are worthless. I'd be going against the master's orders, but so what? As far as I'm concerned, this job here is done. The world are in trouble, and I sort of took off without telling him. Well, that makes both of us. I ran off too. All I have to do is think it, and the Star Shard will take me anywhere I want to go. At least I thought it would. I haven't quite got the fine points down like... When or where. It just kind of kicks in whenever it wants to. But I wouldn't have met you if it hadn't brought me here. 
<laughs> you know, it might not be an accident. Maybe it starts working because it's reacting to something. Hmm? Huh?